Yo, what's going on, guys? Your boy Cinematic, and this was the results from my week 13. Uh, I actually won, so I clinched the number one spot by in the playoffs, which now my fucking, um, you know, ended up going 9-4, and four, but that doesn't matter anymore because everything pretty much resets for the playoffs. I got the Toyota biggest blowout of the week. Got over 201 points in my fantasy this week. I wish I could do that when it mattered in the playoffs, but we'll see. Because I had already clinched the playoff spot anyways, but, uh, whoa, hold on. Let me go ahead and show you, this is what happened. I beat my boy Aaron 201 to 127. I picked my shit perfectly this time, I think. Larry Fitzgerald was the only disappointment, but, um, Josh Cribbs was the only guy I could have put in, and he would only got me .20 points more, so it didn't really make a big difference. Going to look on the waiver wire this week, see if there's anybody to pick up. Um, I'm not going to do it right this second, but like I said, uh, click that off of there. I was in second place, but uh, Boyd Morris ended up getting bumped down into second place because he lost. I lost on the points by winning the points for the season by not very much at all. 10 or 12 points, which is crazy. Because I didn't even think uh, that I was anywhere close. But let's see. For the first week. Uh, yeah, see, we don't have eight teams and we only have six teams in the playoffs. So 16 playoffs. So I won't play till second week. And I play the winner of the four and five seed. So hopefully... Cinemax is going to pull it out, goddammit, but I'm going to get out of here. Um, let me know how you guys' fantasy football is going, and if you have any questions, let me know. Peace.